This is Judge Patty Mayo. Both parties have agreed to abide by the judgment handed down today. The winner will be paid by Patty, and the loser will be subject to the resources of the court to collect their debt. Court is now in session. A missing gold necklace has Shadrach Shaparo demanding $1,500 from Jalen Primus. But Jalen has a different take, countersuing for defamation after being accused of theft on social media. Because the chain is gold-plated, outdated, and overrated, that's why. I could've sent him to jail. I could've did a lot of things. So how do I know this chain is $1,500 to begin with? Hey, you know what I got in the glove? So look at his shoes. Do you think he can afford a $3,000 chain? Yo, Ani, I'm just, I'm just asking where's the chain? The wrong, and the wrong, and the wrong, and the wrong. You said 500? I said 450. I'm sorry, Jalen. I hope you find your chain. <laughs> One day, my uh, nah. I'm good. I'm gonna say hours. I'm gonna say hours. It's hours. Oh, you wanna give me a lot, so let's go where you wanna go. Court calls Shapiro versus Primus. Mr. Shapiro is suing Mr. Primus for fifteen hundred dollars, which is the cost of his brand new ten K ten carat gold necklace, which you were gonna sport all around town and flash blah 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 blah. The only person that knew this change was purchased was Jalen, and he went with the. So basically, Mr. Shapiro, you're claiming that Mr. Primus stole a necklace from you worth fifteen hundred dollars. Is that the entirety of your case? Yes, Your Honor. And Mr. Primus, you say you didn't steal the jewelry, um, and you're countersuing for defamation of character as he's been posting pictures on social media with the words "tweaker thief." Indeed. Okay. Uh, Mr. Shapiro, your version of events? Um, pretty much, he paid for gas, I paid for dinner, we went out shopping downtown, I picked up this nice chain, just like taking care of it. Um, got back in the car, put the chain in the glove compartment, and we decided to go to the club. We went to the club, after the club we came back, I chopped them home, the chain was gone. Do you have any evidence that he took your chain? The only fact is that, you know, I took him to the club, we left the club, He's the only person that was there in the car. He's the only person that was there with me the whole day. Do you have a receipt for the chain? I have the picture of the chain, but I just turned my phone off because it was inside it. Do you have a receipt for the chain? Um, my sister has a receipt. It's my sister's jewelry shop, C1 Building. It's what? My sister's jewelry shop in C1 Building. Okay. Can you get, pull up a picture of the chain for me? Yes, sir. Mr. Primus, your series of events. I don't recall the chain being missing at all. Okay, do you have proof that he's been Posting tweakers. Posting, yeah, posting pictures on social media? Yes, I do. Can I see that? If he's claiming that it's costume jewelry and he was there when he purchased it. It's an Instagram post. Were you there when you purchased the necklace? I was in the shop, yes I was. It's just a screenshot of a post. Okay. He was in the shop but didn't see the- That definitely doesn't qualify for defamation of character. Um, there's no picture of him, there's no last name. It could be any Jalen. It could be a Jalen from a TV show. Oh, Judge, if they're all part of the same social group, then people are gonna know, people are gonna know who it is. That's like my big brother. I'm um, he, yeah, he's like, okay, let's make it like this. He's like a young kid to me. The, the, the logical way of doing this, when I mean, it just happened like Cinco de Mayo, and it's, I could've called the police. I could've sent him to jail. I could've done a lot of things. Now with no evidence, you couldn't have. You could've done anything, Judge. There's, there's absolutely no evidence. So. I decided to take them to court. Unless you have evidence, unless you have evidence of a crime, you can't, you have no other option. No other option. So it's civil. So he's learning from this, from his mistakes. I think you're learning from this. I guess I'm learning too, Your Honor. Judge, is there, is there, there's no pawn receipt? There's no proof that's the mail? That's the only picture I'm getting. That's the only picture you're getting, Your Honor. This close up, blurry, shitty picture of a gold chain. I mean, that's the first picture I took of the chain and then we went to go get it in the shop. So how do I know that this chain is fifteen hundred dollars to begin with? Um, we can call my sister. Her name is Martha Mendoza, fifth floor, Central Times, C one building, downtown Miami, Florida. Why wouldn't you have not brought her with you, or brought a receipt with you? I didn't have enough time to get. Because the chain is gold plated, outdated, and overrated. That's why. Yeah, but the chain I still would have gave it to my mother. Where's That's the, the point. Chain at, huh? If you return the chain, I could have gave it to my mom. Mr. Primus, if you could, or Primus, if you could speak up into the mic just a little bit louder. Yeah, and I believe he's on dope. Aaron, I don't think that he has any claim for defamation. Well, he absolutely has a claim for defamation, Judge. They, he, he admitted they were basically in the same social profile. So how, who else would know who Jalen is? They're in an the entire network. Your Honor. So if he's posting that on Instagram, he's posting that on social media. Now it's out for the entire world to see and for their friend circle. And you have no ev and you have no evidence that he stole your necklace whatsoever. Um, Your Honor, he's the only person that's in the car. He's with me when I bought the chain. We went to the club. This is not a criminal trial. 
I mean, it's not a criminal. Charge. That's hearsay. I mean, that's sorry. Circumstantial. If the chain was left in the car when they went to the club, yeah, someone could have taken it when you were at the club. No, but not, my windows wasn't broke. None of the cars were unlocked. I was in the club with you the whole time. And yes, and then when we left the club. Yeah, did you valet your car at the club? No, I didn't valet. This is a regular parking lot. So when we left the club, I dropped them home. It's missing. I mean, the intention was me to flash. You could lose it. Maybe it's stuck. It could be stuck back behind the glove box for all we know. It could have fallen. Back. It could have been. I searched. Now, the point of the whole thing is that I could have gave it to my mother. The, the, whole, the point of me working that whole week. The point week, is that you could have given it to your mother? No. The point is I was going to give it to my mother. I was going to flash it. I worked all year for it. I was going to flash it, whatever, go around with it. But the point, my intention was to give it to my mother. So your point was to purchase this gold necklace and you were going to flash it around town, show people. Yeah. Which makes a lot of sense when you walk into a club without it. If I'm going to flash it. Yeah, if I'm going to flash it, I'm going to leave my glove box. If I'm going to a club right after I bought a chain. Hey, you know what I got in the glove? <laughs> 10K. I'd, I'd wear it here, but who's gonna wear it? It's 10K. I mean, it's too heavy. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. We're not gonna flash something that small in the club. It's okay. not big. It's not platinum. It doesn't have diamonds. So the claim, the only claim that seems to be outstanding is that you are defaming Jalen at this point by bringing him on a TV program and calling him a thief. I thought we were better than that, man. Court finds that Jalen has evidence. He has credibility. Of defamation of character? I'm uh, missing work for this too. He has, Jalen, Did you, at, at any point, did you try to mitigate the, the, the situation with Mr. Shapiro or? One of the first instances of me knowing about the situation was this test message right here. Other than that, I was not known that his chain was either missing or stolen. Okay. Dude, it's not, it's not up to my client to have to repay somebody for losing a necklace. That's he could have returned it to the pawn. He could have returned it to the shop. That's all I, all I know. I mean, it's, I don't got no insurance on it. There's no insurance. I can't. So look at his shoes. Do you think he can afford a $3,000 chain? Does your client have any damages due to the defamation of character? You don't need damages to prove defamation of character, Judge. I'm just, I'm just talking, I'm just asking because of the amount. It's your reputation in the, in the neighborhood, that's priceless. But he doesn't have- But has, has, the, has that text negatively impacted you in any way? It may in the future, strongly. I'm a, I'm a certified home inspector and- So we're not gonna, so we're not gonna say there's any active damages? The, well, people have seen it, right? But it's no damages now, your honor. So I'm pretty sure people have thinking badly of me. Okay. And that hurts my reputation. I think that's worth the same claim that he made against him, $1,500. My, okay, your reputation is hurt. Okay, cool. You're supposed to be my big brother, fam. And this is why I took you to court. Mr. Shapiro, unfortunately, and you have no evidence. You do have some credibility. No, you don't. So where's the chain? That's the, your honey, I'm just, I'm just asking where's the chain? Chain that could have just- You're just all in the wrong and the wrong and the wrong and the wrong and the wrong. I mean, your honor, I searched my car back and forth, the glove compartment, and then- Mr. Primus, however, is not in the wrong and is clearly gonna be entitled to something. Court recommends a judgment to Mr. Primus for $400. I'm also missing work, Your Honor. I'll, I'll pressure wash on the side. Besides me working at Five Guys, because I flip burgers on the side, I'm a manager there. I'm missing work at pressure wash and I had two jobs lined up. That's a few hundred dollars each. It's a baseless accusation, dude. He's just now drug his name through the mud, not only on social media, but on a TV show. I had to drive all the way out here to come and defend myself on some Well, I think the TV show has redeemed his reputation more than it's hurt it. Okay, so what's your, what's your counter offer? Judge, what about 750? That's half the price of the chain that he alleges my client stole with zero evidence, plus the time he's missing from work, plus if his boss finds out about this and finds out that he's been accused of a crime. And that's just the risk I'm still taking. I give him 450. Your, your Honor, I think being on the TV show has not harmed his reputation in any way. I think it's repaired his reputation. I don't feel that moving, like I, I understand he missed work, but what he did by coming on the show is probably mitigated any of the damage that was done because he, he's proven that he had nothing to do with it. That's inaccurate. Judge, like we all, we all know, innocent until proven guilty. We know, I think about the countless cases where people have been found not guilty, yet their reputations are, are ruined for their Judge, lives. Judge, don't be like other court cases where we're guilty until proven innocent. Be different. That's true. I can award you $450. You said 500? I said 450. When it comes to the matter, Mr. Shapiro, I'm gonna give you $150 credit for time 
on your judgment. We can take it as debt or we can schedule you a date to enter jail for the remaining balance. I'm going to jail. What jail dates do we have? Uh, the 23rd and 24th. Do you want to come in the 23rd or the 24th at 1 p.m.? 24th, 1 p.m. What's that? The 24th, 1 p.m. Sounds great, Your Honor. 24th at 1 p.m. Um, we'll allow you to repay your debt of the $400 um, in addition to walking out of the jail with money in your pocket. Well, I'm What's sorry, Jalen. No, I was just going to tell him I'm sorry. You can tell him sorry. It's all good, fam. It's all good, thanks. I hope you find your chain. I hope I find it too. What's the rate? That should be worth something, Judge. What's that? That should be worth something. Well, we're gonna consider the we're gonna consider the rate that you're gonna get for being in jail. I recommend the standard rate. Six days. I agree. Six days. Six days, uh, and you'll. You wanna you wanna speak up for him? Speak up for him? Yeah. It's pretty good. Six days, and he'll walk out with four hundred in his pocket, and. And have your debt paid back. I don't want to overstep, Judge, but he think, did. He did apologize. He accepted his apology. I think that's worth think, at least one. I think it's a yeah. Well, I was you know, I was a lot lower than that before. How about a day? <laughs> five days. One day, my and a half. No, five days. That's the max. Can the minimum be three? No, five days, and he walks out with four. I tried, fam. Yeah, you know he tried, but it's okay. You accept that offer? Uh, no. Nah. I'm good. You don't accept that offer? Five days in jail? I mean, give me 10. I'll take a lot. What's that? Give me 10. I'm like, since we go all in, I'm the wrong guy. I don't think you want more time. So. All right, that's it. We might as well get more. He's trying to get a little bit. So you understand the way Dutchbury jail works? Oh, you want to give me a lot. So let's go where you want to go. No, no, no. The way Dutchbury jail works is if you, the maximum you're going to get for walking out of that jail, when you walk out of the jail, you're going to walk out with $400 in your pocket. And his debt's now paid, right? Because I paid him your debt. Mm. Right. So you're gonna walk out of jail with $400. Now how many hours it takes you to walk out of jail is a whole nother game, mm. right? So that's why I said I recommend five hours. Okay. I'm gonna say hours, I'm gonna say hours. It's hours. All right. That's just hours. All right, you judge, I'll take five hours. And that's that's great, because normally that'd be a 10 hour sentence. Uh, judge, but make sure the record reflects it's 450, not 400. 450. I'll do 50 push-ups for extra 50. Fine, 450, but then six hours. That's nothing. I eat that. All right. With the sandwich. Uh, 75 on the rate. Release him and put him back in. All right. 150 credits served plus the, plus the jail time. Thank you. How did you feel about the ruling today? I mean, it's probably true. I did definitely his character. He's my little brother. I probably put him through a whole ring of fire on him. He probably put his name in gasoline. So he deserves it. Next time on Judge Patty Mayo. That Veronica is a horrible singer. I don't know where to begin, honestly. Does she is she submitting the uh, drunk images? No, but I have one of you, and I'll make sure that he sees that. Where's your wife? She couldn't attend today because... Because she knows it's bullshit, that's why. This is a shit playlist. My guest started leaving because this lady was singing. Should stay, I will only be in... You're gonna get me copyright strict.